What's up everybody, welcome back. Uh, so this week's going to be a little different than every other week. Um, not going to be having videos on Tuesday and Thursday, but instead I'm going to have videos on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And there's a big reason for that. We're at that time of the year where we're transitioning between fishing season and hunting season, and we needed as you saw we we started to prep our property for this year's upcoming season so the reason there's going to be so many videos this week is because not only are we going up to check the cameras for the first time and there's going to be some beautiful deer on those cameras but we're also going to be going up and doing some coyote hunting so this is going to be a four-part series for the beginning of our hunting season. I went out and bought my 2019 hunting license this year, uh, today, and Dad is going to be going this evening, and then tomorrow morning early, we're getting up, we're gonna go out, we're gonna set out the predator calls, and we're gonna try to coax some unsuspecting coyote into our pots to eradicate them and get rid of them because they are a huge nuisance and they've been scaring our poor little tiny baby deers to where they don't want to come around and we can't hunt them so that's the basic gist of what this week's gonna be going on so Wednesday Thursday Friday the videos will be coming out at 8 p.m. instead of 6 p.m. so stay tuned for those and as always Thank you for coming by. Thank you for watching the videos. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for all the support you have been given to the channel. And I just want to let you guys know I appreciate you. And I appreciate everything that you've done for the channel so far. So I hope you guys enjoy this this little, uh, I don't even know what to call it. I don't, I don't, I don't know. Leave a, leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys think I should call this series of videos because it's going to happen every year around this time so hopefully it's good hopefully you guys enjoy it and I'll see you in the morning oh bye so we're having to do some prep out there in the property starting out that's gonna be the first segment of this video is basically what we're getting together to take out there for our deer to feed on there's a couple black bear out there that I want them to come in and feed I want to see what they're doing what their habits are you know what time of the day they're doing what and to do that I've gotten some stuff together to mix all together make a delicious delicious menu for them to choose from and to be able to eat their little hearts out so here's basically what I'm going to be taking out there and I'm going to give you guys a layout of basically what our plan is for going out to the property so you'll know for tomorrow's video so yeah here we go we did last time we're taking corn out um, we're not going to mix it all together before we get out there I think it's just easier to transport up to the top of the mountain without mixing everything together so we've got 120 pounds of corn 40 pounds of cherry crush, 20 pounds of apple crush. I've got two gallons of deer attractant minerals, three gallons of pure minerals, about a half a gallon of molasses, and a gallon of apple crush, which I'm going to be mixing with that there. All this stuff is going to get mixed up on top of the mountain. We're going to spread it all around. We're going to be digging some some holes up there to get some water access to these deer up on top of the mountain. There's like a little spring that runs up there, so we're going to try to kind of irrigate that over to some of our hunting plots where we're going to be setting up stands. And that way we've got food, water, and shelter for them up there. 
Uh, those are three of the biggest concerns for deer is, is their food because they want to eat their water because they have to drink and their shelter because they don't want to get killed. So we want to make sure that where we're hunting through the season has all three of those. It has an abundance of it. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be digging some holes. We're going to be spreading this corn. We've got two entry points up to the land. We started clearing off one last time we were out there and we're going to clear off the other and try to get a nice clean quiet path to our stands. Um, another thing we're going to be doing is checking our cameras. We're going to be checking, we put them out three weeks ago and we're going to be checking those to see exactly what kind of activity we've got coming through there. The things that we want to see are deer and bear mostly. We want to see some turkey out there and some people don't want to see this but I want to see, I want to see coyotes because last year they disrupted a few of my hunts and I'm not too happy about it. So I really want to get those coyote out of there. I want to start pushing them away from the property to where they're not going to be coming in and bothering me and disrupting my hunts this year. So that's a basic gist of it guys. Um, yeah, so we're getting ready to pack all this stuff up and we're going to head out to the property here in the early morning. So we're going to go in here and get some sleep after we pack all this stuff up and we'll see you guys in the morning.